In this video, let us understand how to write ASP.NET C# -sharp program to calculate BMI. So what is BMI? BMI stands for Body Mass Index. BMI indicates how healthy or how obese you are. So here is the formula to calculate the BMI. Weight divided by height into height or height square. So here is the BMI values and the corresponding result. If it is less than 8.5, you are underweight. If the BMI value is 8.5 to 24.5, then it is a normal. 25 to 30 overweight, 35 to 39.5 uh, severe obesity, 40 to 44.5 morbid obesity and then a, anything greater than 45 is a super obesity. This we need to show when they enter the height and the weight. So let's see that how to write this program. I'll show you this one. So meanwhile, please subscribe to our channel and also if you go to our channel, you can see a lot of project related videos. So watch them and keep learn and also there are free projects are available. You can also download and practice and get an experience. So if you click on iBlix tutorials, you'll click videos. Here you can find a lot of project related videos, uh, particularly this is a student result system. You can download the whole project and keep try. And here is a sign up form. So if you want to learn like step by step, you can learn all these things from our channel. So I suggest when you have free time, please go through them and learn from it. Okay, let's start with the Visual Studio. So here we have Visual Studio. Sign up form one I told that is created here. So now let's create a new form for BMI. So go to project, add a new item. So it is a web form. So this is BMI calculation. Fine. So give the name BMI calculation form and click card. A new page is created. So we can go to sign up form. So we are we already created the style. I just copy this. I just go to source and then I'll paste it on the top. So you want to change the background color. So this is done. Then we want some picture. So we just go to design. You can see there is a picture here. I can copy the picture here. We can create new one also. If you want to know like how to create the new one, so just watch the previous video. And now we want to change the picture, okay? So in order to change the picture, first you need to import the picture. The one picture which I already created here in the paint actually, body mass index. So I just right click here, go to add, then existing item. Then I'll go to D drive. So here I have a picture. So this is the one. So now it's bmi.png. Now we need to link that to this image. So therefore just go to image URL. So bmi.png. Now you can see that body mass index. Next we record some labels and button. So we can copy them here. So you can see there is a one label here. I'll copy this. I'll take this one. I'll take this. And we record a button. So we can copy this. Control C. Now we can go to source code. Before the form, you can uh, paste all these things. So ensure that you are pasting form closing here. Make some space and then paste it here. Sorry. Okay. So here, what you have to do is, so you have to go to source code. This you have to copy. So then you have to paste it here. Okay. So only label one is coming. So I'll copy the text box. Then copy the button. So we can create all new but take little more time. So therefore if it's already there, easy to copy them. Right. So now you can take up this button up. So here you can say calculate. So here you can give the message, enter, wait. So this is enter, wait and this is the text box one. 
now we can copy this again i just go here control c once twice thrice i can do it three four so now go to this and select the fourth one bring it down uh, select the third one bring it down then second one okay we can bring it down now you want text box um, so again go to source copy this this html code will automatically generate now what we do is we copy that then automatically it will change the text box name so this is a text box 2 so go to this select text box 2 and then bring it down so now change this to enter height height in meters actually this is in kg once you calculate here we want to show the result i'll take out this i'll keep on dot here and i'll take out this i'll keep one more dot here right so now when i click calculate it should calculate the that body mass index so therefore click calculate now here you need to write the code so declare so float as a variable float bmi var bmi var so that is equal to zero in the beginning okay next we need to transfer text box one value to one more variable so therefore you can take w var is equal to zero comma height h var is equal to zero so w var is a weight var is equal to float dot this is parse so parse is to convert so this is text box 1 dot text so same way we can parse the height also so therefore this is 2 this is h this is h var now bmi var is equal to w var so divided by this is h var into h var okay you can have one more bracket here so semicolon so now this value you want to display in the label so in this label so there is a label 4 so you can write label 4 dot text is equal to so this is your bmi value is colon plus bmi var so you can convert it to two string Okay. so let's try this how it works so select this bmi calculation form and then we can run this right so now we can enter the weight so weight is 65 kg and height is 1.68 calculate now you can see that your bmi value is is the value now here you need to give the result whether your obese is a normal or all these things you need to do this you need to write the statements so you have to go to again c sharp code so here you need to write the conditions fine so if this is bmi var 
so it's less than so this is 18.5 so then you can check out the label name so this is a label label 3 so the first is the label 3 dot text that is equal to uh, you are underweight so you can write else so else if statement else if is greater than or equal to 18.5 and it is less than ok so therefore less than so this is 24.9 or because it's less than you can give 30 only no problem 30 so you have a normal weight so it just gives a normal next <coughs> so if it's greater than 30 and less than 40 so you are obese so next is greater than r is equal to 40 and less than sorry some wrong here so this is 24.9 and here it's 24.9 otherwise consider as 25 this is 25 and is less than 30 and is greater than 30 to 40 so here is overweight So this is greater than 32, less than 40, it's obese. Okay, just give us underweight. Normal, overweight, obese. And we can have one more. If it's greater than 40, okay, anything above 40, we can call it as morbidity obese or you can say I obese or I live obese so now if you go back to this so either project is already running so we select this project and here we need to select BMI calculator dot xpx so 50 this is 1.65 so BML value is 18.34 but here is not displaying yeah, what you can do is once you save this file save all then go to this and build result build solutions so after that you can come back and then you can try here so it's working thing now 60 and this is 1.68 calculate so you can see that it show the value here and it is normal now it becomes 70 so here is 60 kg when you calculate you will get 21 so this is normal so if you make it 75 if you calculate so it's a overweight because 26.57 so let's say 85 so it's a obese let's say 120 so it's highly obese so now it's calculating and give the result we can do more actually so keep try this or probably we'll make another video where we want to give the suggestions also and also we can show picturetically how obese he is 
fun so keep watch keep learn try again thank you